Hey guys and what's up? Welcome to my video. This is going to be my four month spectacular. It's not going to be that spectacular. I'm basically just going to talk about my job like I told you guys I would. Um, so beginning with my job, basically, obviously I have YouTube. It is not really sufficient at the moment. I don't get that much money from it. Um, obviously because I'm only getting about two to three hundred views a day off of all my videos combined. Which is not bad, which is not great, but you know, it's like, it's, it's enough to maybe buy me a game at the end of the year. It's really not that much money, you'd be surprised. But my other job currently is actually being a camp counselor at a YMCA. I'm actually not how f sure how far spread YMCAs are, but it's really big in New England. It basically, it's like child watch, they have working out, they have pools, they have a gym. And it's like a monthly membership thing, and you can just do, you can play basketball, you can run. They have like an outdoor track. It's not really an outdoor track. It's like a, they like mapped out a mile. There's like a finish line and an end line, just so if you want to run outside instead of running around an indoor track, which they have going around the basketball court in this specific YMCA. And basically just do whatever you want. So basically what my daily job is, it's around probably 40 hours a week or so. So I work about eight to 10 hour shifts every weekday. Um, sometimes I get days off. I get days off here and there just with scheduling and stuff. And it's pretty cool. Tomorrow I actually got rid of my shift so I could watch my dog. I'll talk about that later, of course. Um, so basically what I do is I, I kind of want to walk you through the every day. So basically what I do is I wake up at 6.30 a.m. in the morning. I take a shower and then it's about seven o'clock and then I eat and then I get my lunch together. I just like pack a little lunch. I, do, I usually do like salad or tuna or something. Something pretty nice, something tasty, something will give me some energy. But um, basically I pack my lunch and then I hop in my car, I drive to work. It's about 15 to 20 minutes away depending on traffic. And then I get there and I go to work. So basically the beginning of the day starts out really boring. You literally sit there, you watch the children. If anything goes wrong, if somebody trips, skins their knee, then you gotta go into the medical shed and then you gotta clean them up. And it really is boring. And then the day starts to kick into gear. We have some like morning announcements type of thing. We have a camp cheer. Um, if you're really interested in the camp cheer, you can comment below, I'll put it in the description. Um, it's pretty stupid. We just yell it as loud as possible. I don't yell it because my voice really is gone most of the time because I am yelling at children all day. Well, not yelling, but I'm not exactly being quiet because when it's really loud, it's hard to talk to other people, so you have to yell loud. It's just like going to a concert. You're going to lose your voice no matter what. So basically, we do the camp cheer, we do the announcements, and then we get around five to ten kids to ourselves. And then we go out for the day, we go into the woods, we have our campsites, they're really just picnic benches in like a cleared out blazed area in the woods. And we put down our backpacks and then we have swim time, we have something called sports and field, which we have a sports and field specialist, quote unquote, that will like set up a game for us. Um, it's pretty sweet. There's some kids that are obviously problematic, I can't mention names, I'm legally obligated to not tell names actually. And basically there's some troublemakers, there's some really cool kids, you can really learn a lot from them. A lot of them have like different mindsets. You'd be really surprised. It's kind of amazing. Um, and that's really what I do every single day. It's a lot of work. You're outside all day. I've been sunburned probably about 40 times this summer. I need to start wearing sunblock. I'm going to end up like breaking out somewhere. Um, so basically, that's what I do. That's what I do on a daily basis. So, I wanted this to be more of a personal video, and I didn't want to drag it on too long, but I don't want it to have about four minutes. So that's enough about my job. If you want to hear more, ask some questions below. Um, I'll answer them. Next, I want to talk about my dog. My dog currently, his name is Shelby. If you watched my most recent Minecraft video, I think episode five or so, um, I at the end of the video, I had to cut it short because he was in my room panting a lot. So basically what he has is he has um, air in his chest cavity, which makes him breathe funny, a little heavy, and he ended up going to the vet about three times. They ended up draining like some fluid or some air that wasn't supposed to be there in his lungs, and he just has trouble breathing. He seems to be doing much better, but of course we have to wait. I think it's a two-week time period. He's not supposed to... He's not supposed to exercise too much. He's not supposed to get very, like, pumped up. His heart can't go really fast, or he could, like, have a heart attack, or he could pass out or have a seizure or something. So we got to make sure he's staying calm, which means keeping him away from my other dog. I have a pit bull, 
and he's amazing, but he's extremely hyper. You gotta play with him all the time, and it, we gotta keep him away from him, basically. So that's really all I do all day. I go to camp. I work that around 40 hours a week. I stay home, watch my dogs, and I do YouTube. Uh, YouTube is amazing. So far I have about 31,000 total views, which is crazy. If I were to divide 31,000 by 235 subscribers, that's how many views you've got that they're giving me. Imagine an audience like in a movie theater. I don't even think they, they would not be able to fit 31,000 people in a movie theater. The way I look at it really is, can you even fit 31,000 people in like Fenway Park? Would you be able to fit 31,000? I'm not sure. I think the seating is actually like 28,000. I'm probably completely wrong. But I would be able to fill out a venue. I'd be able to sell that to people. I'd be able to do that kind of stuff. Even 256 people, that's more than a movie theater. That's like me making a movie and everybody watching it. 256 of you. Or 256. 225 of you. I hope I do get the 256 eventually. But see, the, my mindset right now is just post, 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 post. But the problem is I just can't drag those viewers in. That's where I need you guys to help me. I mean, I hate to ask for stuff. I usually never ask for people to subscribe, comment, and like the video unless it's like an informational video and you want to see more. But I would really love for you guys to show your friends. I My brother watches my videos. My brother's friend watched my videos. He told his brother he likes Minecraft, and he said he was really, I was really good at Minecraft. He talked to him. That's just three people subscribing right there just from spreading the word. Even if you're just like, oh, bud, I talk to you every day. We play Minecraft every day. Go check out this channel. I've been watching him for a while. One sub is everything to me. When I wake up and I see that I gained one sub, honestly, that's, like, cool. That is amazing. If I woke up and had 500 extra subs, I would literally shit myself. No joke, I would shit myself. I'd have to go to the bathroom and I'd have to wipe myself up. No joke. But yeah, that's really all I'm going to talk about today. If you guys have any questions about my job, if you have any questions about YouTube, pretty soon I'm going to be doing a professional recording of uh, my recording, if that makes any sense. Kind of recordception. But it's more, um, I'm going to show you guys how I record my videos. I have multi-channel streaming. I have tons of stuff. I have a Blue Yeti microphone. Um, the setup video that I've been talking about on and off for a while is going to come at 300 subs. So once I hit 300 subs, you guys are going to see my room. It's pretty sweet. I got a custom-built PC. I got three screens. I got everything going on. But yeah, that's really going to talk about. The video is dragging on because I like to talk. So um, I'll see you guys later.